name is Tony Hagoff, and I have been an actor for quite a few years now. She's very strong, your friend, dear. <laughs> Hi, I'm Andrew Stone. Um, I am an entertainer. Um, I sing, dance, and act. And I was found on the Pineapple Dance Studios. Shane Lynch is my name, and most people know me from being a band called Poison. During the Panther run, that's our 20-year anniversary. Being part of a band was something. Magical, without a shadow of a doubt. Uh, difficult at times, you know, emotional times. Uh, I've loved every minute of it. It's something I never expected to be in, as far as the music is concerned. I'm a car freak, more into race cars, and more petrol runs through my veins than anything else. Uh, so I was just chance, lucky, and I believe in chance and luck. For many years before the Pineapple Show got commissioned, um, which was a few years now, Ago, three years ago, I did a lot of shows in the West End. Um, I toured with um, Ricky Martin, I sung with Tina Turner, um, I danced with Britney, and um, I'm not name dropping by the way. Uh, <laughs> yeah, I know Shane actually. I, I met him um, once we did the Celebrity Big Brother thing. We had a rap party at the Sugar Hut, and he was there, and I said hello. And yeah, I sort of like our paths have crossed a few times. He's a lovely guy, so yeah, I can't, I can't wait to work with him. Chickens go in, pies come out. Ooh, what kind of pies? Apple. My favourite. Well, I mean, it's, a, it's one heck of a long career, you know. And uh, it's quite hard when anybody asks me, what have you done? I always refer them to Google and the movie database, you know, which has all the things that I've done on it. I've been bit by a bat. Yes, I see. My first panto was 2004, and pretty much onwards from there, I always played the same character, and that was the prince. So, this is the first time I'm kind of, when I say coming out of my comfort zone, it's a character I don't know, so I'm certainly going to be challenged. I remember going to the Panto when I was a child, and it was just magic, always magic. To be a part of that kind of uh, crowd participation and family values is the way I see it, in amongst the Christmas period, which is always very important. I was more than happy to kind of get involved. Pantomime makes you feel good, it's got a feel good factor and I think that you know people need that especially at the moment with the doom and gloom of the uh, economy and stuff and anything else that's going on out there so Pantomime rocks. I think it'll be just a one amazing show this one, this could be the best. Yeah.